want to congratulate you guys on when you're gone. Thank you. And if you could tell everybody a little bit about the song, how, you know, the writing process and why you selected that one as a single. Sure. Yeah, um, so the song was something really born out of something that our co-writer said one day and we went in there and I had this title called When You're Gone and I originally meant it to be When You're Gone, I Miss You, Sappy Love Song, blah blah blah. And they all shot it down like instantly. So. Um, I kind of regrouped and heard this lick he was playing and said, you know, my spouse is really kind of sexy when she gets a little tipsy. And um, so I thought, when you're gone, that still works. And so maybe my starving self threw it out there again, and we ended up just writing it at a different uh, angle. Yeah. Um, Brennan, the co-writer, he had a video of his wife the night before. <laughs> and uh, she was, she had some of their real money, and she had too much to drink, so she was, like, making it rain on the yeah. dance floor. <laughs> And I was like, Brennan, do you think your wife is sexier when she's tipsy, or, or do you get like annoyed? And he was like, that is when I think she is the sexiest, because she gets out of mommy mode, right? and she just lets loose. And so, just to reiterate that, that thought and that idea, we thought that was such a cool spin on the title, and something a little more fun. It, summertime was coming up, we had just come off of Hey Whiskey, which is kind of a more heartbreak, and honestly dark and depressing song. So we we wanted something that was a little more fun and sexy and we call it our summer jam. So yeah. That's a really good yeah. Because when you hear the title you don't exactly that's that's where you go is you think, oh right. somebody lost someone. Mm -hmm. So right. yeah, that's really cool. Are you guys putting a video out for that? Is that already in the process or can you Funny talk about you that? that. <laughs> that's so, why we're so tired today. That's why we're so tired today. Um, we just got through wrapping up the video last night. Oh, awesome. And um, yeah, it's great. We're really excited about it. Um, I think it's going to be a great representation of what the song is. Very cool. All right. And so I wanted to ask also for people that may not have seen you live, what can they expect in a live show? Sure. With you know, meet songs like this and stuff. What can they? What What do you guys, you know, offer up in a live show? Sure, uh, I I like to tell people they're going to get a wide variety uh, of what we do. They're going to get the singles, of course, that have been out on the highway and on Spotify. All the hits, all the hits. <laughs> the <greatest> hits. <laughs> all the hits. But um, what I love about what we do, we, we bring a lot of energy to our live show, and even the cover songs that we do in our show, you get to know us through what we play. Because Trey's a rock and roll guy. And, and I'm a country girl, so we'll play covers that we grew up on, and we kind of tell our story throughout our show. Oh. So I think people kind of get to know us through our music. Mm -hmm. um, so even the covers are intentional. They're not just random, oh, we like to play this. Like, there's a purpose behind each and every one of them. So That's really cool. Yeah, that's neat. Um, and I know that you guys have been longtime friends mm -hmm. and, you know, a duet for a long time or, you know, in a group. Um, what makes the two of you a great team? To work together, we call each other. We're the yin and the yang. We're completely opposite. Uh, I'm a type A person, <laughs> and for lack of a better term, super anxious and just all up in your face all the time, uh, which is not a bad thing. But Jerry has a more calming presence and takes things. Uh, he has more patience than I do. So we make a great team because uh, I'm the person that's gonna be like kick us in the butt when we need to be, and Trey's gonna be the person that's gonna calm us down when we need to be calm. And, relax and, and focus on the task at hand. So uh, she tells me what to do, and I tell her to chill out. <laughs> <laughs> that's that's perfect. To <laughs> yeah, that, he explained it way better than I did. <laughs> See, he even knows how to finish your sentence. Yeah, yeah. right. <laughs> yeah. Well, also, there's a comfortability that comes along with knowing each other for so long. Too, mm -hmm. we trust each other. We have each other's backs, and and I know Trey's going to be there for me no matter what. So, mm -hmm. yeah, in the writers' room or in the show or whatever, we just we always have each other's backs. That's awesome. Yeah. Well, now that the single is out, the video is clearly finished and in the works. So, yeah. what's ahead for the rest of the year? What are you guys working on? So, uh, video will be premiering on CMT probably in about a month. Awesome. Uh, probably less, sooner less than, than that. <laughs> we'll, <laughs> we'll see. Uh, did a cool behind the scenes feature on it, so we'll be seeing that as well. Um, we're touring all over the country. Um, we have been all summer and we continue uh, until basically the end of the year. And also, we have a little uh, project we've been working on, and we'll have some new music coming out pretty soon. So, When You're Gone was really kind of a lead off to some new stuff that's coming soon. Awesome. Yeah. Very cool. Okay, and then finally, just go ahead and let everybody know where they can find you on social media and sure. connect with you guys on there. Uh, you guys can check us out at Smithfield Music. Make sure you put the music, not just Smithfield, you'll get the hand company. 
uh, Twitter, Facebook, Instagram, YouTube, at Smithfield Music, and check us out on smithfieldmusic.com. Awesome. Thank you, guys. Yeah.